so this video is going to be about um, references and um, specifically about um, when we attach a reference to a file let me do this for an example we'll take this um, MDF alignment file if we click on it and attach it then I'm uh, this video is going to be about what nested attachments mean and um, let me just bring this reference and um, see what happens when um, the no nesting setting is is applied so I'm gonna click OK and we see that the alignment file comes in um, perfectly fine so now let me try to do the same thing with another file and I'll tell you um, and you'll be able to see the difference um, and you'll be able to see the purpose of what nesting does so I'm gonna turn off this file that I just attached and then I'm gonna attach one of these con files and what this con means is means that it's a container file which um, which just means that a whole bunch of files are being referenced in to this file and there's nothing there's no elements live in the sheet um, or in the file there's no elements live in the file so if I come here and um, attach this container for the roadway plan I'm gonna open this and I'm gonna leave no nesting I'm gonna hit OK and when I fit screen there's nothing that shows there's nothing here that shows so the trick is if something like this happens to you um, then you'll just need to come here and say live nesting and once you click this live nesting then um, it's gonna go inside this this file and look look at all the references in here and then it's gonna display them on um, in in the current file that you're in which would typically be a um, a sheet a sheet file because you would want to reference in your container um, in a sheet file so here it is now we see that we have um, live nesting and um, and now we're able to see um, all the elements that are in this um, in this file so I think that's pretty much it if you have any questions um, just let me know thanks